join us, sir. We were just about to begin. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I think and you're coming to on a little too strong, Mr. Society. As ARC patrons, you are welcome to explore the castle grounds. However, certain areas are off limits, including the keep, which houses the members' area, convention space, and council meeting. Should you wish to apply for ARC membership, please be aware that such cannot be bought, only earned. All set? Excellent. Follow me, please. Washington, one of our newly appointed chairwomen, has prepared a brand new official ceremony scheduled to take place in the upper courtyard. A stirring ode to rebirth and the enduring spirit of mankind. I believe that is it, ladies and gentlemen. Please enjoy your evening. The bar is right up ahead. Hello, sir. Final club all over again. How does it work? The tokens are hidden throughout the castle, you know, like out of reach places like the ramparts. And the first initiate to collect enough tokens Excuse undergoes me. the polygraph test with the chairwoman. If you're deemed worthy, you get promoted dark member. Hmm. I could do that. So, if. Yeah, I'm not so sure. Depends on your pain threshold, I guess. You see, Zoe Washington up to the face of the chair. Word is, she's brought. Wait, electroshock? But... Something. Every Got Thanks. And every time you make a bad impression. Ladies and gentlemen, fellow Arkians, can I have your attention, please? Now that everybody's here, we're ready to proceed. Please make your way to the upper courtyard. The ceremony is about to begin. Thank you. Not now, Marco. I'm kind of in the middle of something. That's what I wanted to talk to you about. You see? I have one of the tokens. What? How did you... What difference does it make? Look, the token is yours if you want it. But on one condition. You serious? Name it. Okay, here's the deal. I want a seat on the Titan ship. But I don't want to become an ARC member in order to get it. It's too much hassle and responsibility. Wait. You want me to... Buy a seat in my name? Yeah. I'm... No, sorry, Marco, but I can't. If they figure it out, we'll both get expelled. They won't find out. Don't be a chicken, Paul. No, no deal. Now stop bothering me with the time as it is. So, you like the class? Yeah, I know Heidi sent Doro first. I could introduce you, you know, if you give me your token. Right.
Sir? Your proposal, I couldn't help but overhear. Uh, I'm not sure what you're referring to, Mr... Reaper. Your friend wasn't interested, but I am. Hmm. Okay, let's talk. But not here. Follow me. Excuse me, sir. Seems like you're not pleased to come through. What's with that Sorry. weird bird effigy? It's the annual phoenix, sir. Symbolizing the collapse of civilization. Listen here, pal. I'm sorry. You ain't coming through here. It has to be something real. Tokens, come on, Pete. Tokens, they can't all be gone. Wait up, who are you? Do I know you? Let me through. I need those tokens. Let me think. Hmm. Let's see. No.
here, I'm an ARC patron, and that means I pay your wages. Minuscule as they are, so step aside. Now, what would you do in my situation? And don't say take a bribe. You're not getting through here, Anishian. Class times. Could be anything. Tokens, tokens. Come on, need more tokens. Don't throw that. How's oh, that? are interfering with a corpse. That is definitely... Check it out. Come on, go. Sir. Yes, you. Hands off. Right now. Hey, you. Surrender or die. No sudden movements, right mister. Now. Is he taking him on?
Excuse me? See those tokens. I'm afraid that won't cut it, Initiate. Keep searching. Hey, loser. Yeah, you. How's the hunt? Well, feast your eyes on this. That's right. Hey, walk in. Get back. Token, it's mine, you hear me? If I have to report you, I will. Don't think for it. Second, I won't. What, using force makes you feel big and important, is that it? How about you use your brains, asshole? See, this is why your whole bloody gender is falling behind. Whatever, loser. Keep it. I'm still gonna kick your ass. Good work, 47. You've got all the tokens needed to gain access to the initiation. I suggest you find your way to the screening room. There was an ornate door near the courtyard. Hand in your tokens there. Initiate. Let's see those tokens. Congratulations, Initiate. Now the real trial begins. Hey, Miss Washington. An initiate has completed the treasure hunt. Yeah, understood. Bring it into the interrogation room now. So, uh, you think you got what it takes, initiate? You think you got the stomach for what comes next? I can hold my own. Is that so? You some kind of tough guy? Tough is for amateurs. Oh, Miss Washington's gonna have a field day with you. Welcome, initiate. Take a seat. attention. This is a polygraph machine hooked up to an ECT device. That's short for electroconvulsive therapy, and I assure you it packs quite a punch. In a moment, Ms. Zoe Washington is going to ask you a series of questions, and I suggest you answer truthfully, or the machine will know. Is that clear? Very. Good man. Solid work, 47. Let's see if you can't turn this interrogation to your advantage. So, you made it this far, Initiate. But now, the real test begins. Is the machine operational? The ECT device is set to medium voltage. I don't recommend going higher than that. This setup is still largely untested. Well, 
As long as the Initiate speaks the truth, we won't need to. Has my colleague explained the rules to you? Exhaustively. Good. Let's begin. And do not attempt to deceive me. First question. Are you the best in your field? Yes. He's not lying. Very good. Now, are you willing to break the law if required? Yes. Checks out. I see. And can you keep a cool head under pressure? Yes. True. Interesting. Well, you're just perfect, aren't you? Maybe a little too perfect. Are you a reporter working for the liberal media? Yes. He's not telling the truth. Now, why would you lie when the truth plays in your favor? Do you think this is some kind of joke, Initiate? If, if so, trust me, you are sorely mistaken. Amp up the voltage. Yes, Madam Chairwoman. Now, let's try something else. Are you a follower of our late founder, Janus? No. He's not lying. I see. Are you then loyal to Sophia and myself? No. Checks out. Loyal to no one, huh? Perhaps you would like to be chairman of the Ark Society, Initiate? Yes. Nope. He's lying. Look, I don't know what kind of game you're playing, Initiate, but I'm warning you. Do not test me again. Increase the voltage. Yes, ma'am. Now, do you have an ulterior motive for being here? Yes. True. Aha! Uh -huh. I knew you had a secret. You don't look like a reporter to me, so what? Corporate espionage? Do you plan to steal Ark Society trade secrets and sell them for a profit? No. He's not lying. Huh. You're a strange one, Initiate. Your motives are obscure, and I do not trust you. Clearly, you're not what we're looking for. Thank you for your application. You are excused. Um, you should head back to the common areas, Initiate. Better luck next. Now pay attention. This is a polygraph machine. An ECT device. That's short for electroconvulsive therapy, and I assure you, it packs quite a punch. In a moment, Ms. Zoe Washington is going to ask you a series of questions, and I suggest you answer truthfully, or the machine will know. Is that clear? Very. Good man. Solid work, 47. Let's see if you can't turn this interrogation to your advantage. So, you made it this far, Initiate. But now, the real test begins. Is the machine operational? The ECT device is set to medium voltage. I don't recommend... ...and going higher than that. This setup is still largely untested. Well... As long as the Initiate speaks the truth, we won't need to. Has my colleague explained the rules to you? Exhaustively. Good. Let's begin. And do not attempt to deceive me. 
First question. Are you the best in your field? No. False. Now, why would you lie when the truth plays in your favor? Do you think this is some kind of joke, Initiate? If, if so, trust me, you are sorely mistaken. Amp up the voltage. Yes, Madam Chairwoman. Now, let's try something else. Are you a follower of our late founder, Janus? Yes. He's not telling the truth. Look, I don't know what kind of game you're playing, Initiate, but I'm warning you. Do not test me again. Increase the voltage. Yes, ma'am. Now, do you have an ulterior motive for being here? No. Nope. He's lying. Enough! Don't say I didn't ward you, Initiate. You brought this on yourself. Crank it. All the way up. Madam Chairwoman. Zoe, are you sure that's wise? I don't even know how far this thing goes. Could be dangerous. Do it. Now. Moment of truth, Initiate. Are you pretending to be someone you're not? No. False. One target down. Nice work, Lisa. Next up, Sophia Washington. A remote trigger. Must be a kill switch. Hmm. I bet this would make the constant come quietly. But first things first, 47. Focus on the target. Nice work, Lucas. Next up, Sophia Bushett. A remote trigger. Must be a kill switch. Hmm. I bet this would make the constant come quietly. But first things first, 47. Focus on the target.
So, according to its charter, the Ark Society collects priceless art and historical artifacts. Blake thinks Sophia might try and steal back the necklace before it's sealed in the Ark of the Legacy. Hello there. Oh, hello, sir. Excuse me. Hmm? Hmm. I wonder what that was. There. You told me he was dead. 
Colby, you watched him go over the waterfall with a Bowie knife in his back. Now, Sao Paulo, playing what? You... Sophia, looking larcenous as always. Play? I almost didn't recognize you without a Ooh. knife in my back. Wow. You sure got a lot of... I heard that. After the shit you told me. Oh, cool. This professional. Oh, I have no idea. That is Sophia Washington, chairwoman of the Ark Society, professional treasure hunter, and Providence operative. Quite the resume. How are you today, sir? Smooth, 47. Oh. The Sparrow's got nothing on you. Let's see, I trusted you, poor sportsmanship, yada yada yada. Really, Sophia, what a sore loser you are.
Hello there, sir. Sir? It doesn't make sense. Take him down! Sir, it doesn't make sense. What's this now? Blake, you backstabbing son of a bitch. <laughs> Why, hello to you too, Sophie. Sophia. Blake? I'm just saying, if I almost didn't recognize you without a knife in my back. You're well messed up. Your backyard I see that. Can you're you not talk? Seeing the this should future. be good. Follow me. Excellent, 47. Let's give Sophia her heart's desire, shall we? You've got one minute. I did wrong by you, Sophia. I see that now, and I want to make amends. Here, this is rightfully yours. Well, well. Look who comes crawling back. Leave us. You know... We lost three men because of you. Wicked. This was crushed by a rolling boulder. Jago fell into a pit trap. And Zoe and me? We only escaped the arrows by using one of the local guides as a human shield. Now, this is a nice gesture, but it doesn't even begin to make amends. I know. May I? Fine. But not too tight. You know, I... Both targets down. 
Impressive work, 47. And now, to confirm. The Constant. Mr. Gray, what's your status? I'm at the helicopter, but the place is crawling with security. 47, you better bring the Constant to one of the boats in the harbor where it's quiet. You can use the kill switch to coerce him. No! 47, that was our only lead on the partners. Abort mission. Washington's are dead. I have the kill switch. What did you say? How could you know about that? You will head towards the harbor. No sudden moves. No signs or warnings. I will trigger the device if I need to. I know you. The boy in the picture. You have his eyes. Pardon, what's this? Is? Move. I had a notion something didn't sit right with my mentor's betrayal. You murdered him, I take it, to get to me. Not just that. He had it coming. Interesting. It was my impression that you were cured of such sentiment. The good doctor built his serum specifically to target the seats of your emotions. Has Miss Burnwood's sense of justice rubbed off on you? I wonder. Just keep walking. Exciting. <laughs> Who's being funny?